The Student Agriculture Organization warns Yemen will experience a hard period from June to September due to reduced humanitarian aid, rising food prices and increased market dependence. The following report has more. The Food and Agriculture Organization FAO has warned that Yemen will face a lean period from June to September due to a decrease in humanitarian food assistance in healthy controlled areas and a projected increase in food prices in areas held by the legitimate government. FAO reported that during the first quarter of 2024, the food security situation deteriorated compared to the same period last year, with the number of households experiencing inadequate food consumption, increasing to 49% nationwide. The organization expects these deteriorations to persist as household purchase power has significantly decreased due to the decline in seasonal agriculture and casual labor opportunities. Civil servants are facing extreme delayed salary payment amid a challenging economic outlook, while reduced humanitarian food assistance is increasing depends on markets. Despite increased disruption in the Red Sea, the importation of food and fuel imports continues normally, ensuring sufficient food supplies in the markets. The proportion of households with inadequate food consumption nationally rose to 49% in March 2024, up from 43% in the last quarter and 47% in the same month last year. Most of the governments experiencing the largest declines in food consumption are in healthy controlled areas, including Al-Jawf, Haja, Taiz, Sada, Marib, and Arema, compared to Aden and Hadramaut in the government-controlled areas. Field reports also indicated a surge in the number of malnutrition children during the period under review. The cholera situation in Yemen, spanning from March 14th to April 2nd, 2024, continues to raise concerns, with the Ministry of Health counting 7,364 suspected cases and 260